Hi, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can save photos to the Windows computer for your Samsung Galaxy S20, S20 Plus, or the S20 Ultra. So the first and easiest way is simply uh, plugging the USB cable into your phone. This is a USB-C port. You probably need another cables um, with the USB-A port because the cable that comes with the phone is USB-C to USB-C and you need to get a different cables to connect to the computer so luckily I have got one from my older model you might not have one um, if you are using a new uh, phone if you are using the cable that comes with the phone so once it is connected uh, all you have to do now is to um, so I'm sorry I'm just going to close this one for now I'm just um, going to show you three different ways how to do it. Okay, so now all I have to do is open up my computer. So I'm just going to press um, Windows and E key on my keyboard to quickly open up. And here is the Galaxy S20 Ultra 5G. So you can click on that to open up. And then on the phone, we're going to click on card and then DSIMS and then camera. So this is depends on where you have stored your photos. It could be on the phone or on your SD card. So at the moment it is on SD card. And then select a couple of photos. I'm going to select a couple of, of photos to copy over. So right click and on the mouse and then click on copy. And then choose where you want to copy. I'm going to copy into a folder on my computer. So here is my uh, photos folder. I'm going to open it and then right click then click on paste and that will start to uh, save the, com um, the photos onto the computer so that is from the phone over to the computer now if we go back to the Galaxy S20 Ultra uh, root folder you can see I can also choose phone so this is the internal memory and the, uh, the other one is the SD card memory and here you can also click on DSIM and then camera and it's also show you some uh, of the videos or photos that you can also copy over so this is a small one I'm going to copy it over so this is the one way how you can do it is uh, using a USB uh, cable to uh, copy the files directly over into your computer another way you can do it is to um, open up uh, Samsung DeX you need to uh, set up Samsung DeX uh, for this to work but once it is uh, set up this it's fairly easy to use here is a uh, Samsung Dex so on my phone I can uh, tap on start now so for this to work you need to set up your phone Samsung Dex on your phone as well as on your computer on your computer you need to install Samsung Dex now you can uh, look in the link description in the description description sorry description and then there's a link in there and then you can uh, uh, click on it and I will show you how you can uh, install and uh, pair up with uh, Samsung Dex so in here um, you can click on gallery so once Samsung Dex is opened uh, click on gallery uh, what Samsung Dex does is it allow you to use your phone uh, functions and comp uh, capability on directly on your computer uh, screen so I don't need, really need to touch my phone at all. So here I can open up the photos. I can view it. Uh, if I'm happy with these photos, I can simply uh, drag it onto my computer. Uh, I should be able to drag it. So from here I can just drag it and then drop it on the computer like that. And you can see the file will shortly be saved. So save somewhere over here. I can also open up. So we place this file in a destination folder because we already had files in that folder before. So over here, let's say I'm going to delete everything. And then I'm going to drag it over. So I'm just going to make it smaller so you can easily see it by my, what I am doing. So here I can uh, select uh, multiple photos by simply pressing on the shift key on the keyboard and then uh, select multiple files and then you can drag it over to uh, the folder on your computer so that is another way to uh, copy it over I guess with Samsung Dex it's nice because 
you might not want to copy everything only certain files that you like so you can uh, preview of the photos first if you're happy you can select it and then drag it onto your folder so that is one of the other way now the last uh, way is to use um, uh, the your phone app that is on the computer so this one you don't even need to uh, connect so uh, you don't even need to connect using a USB cable I can unplug it and you can see it is now not plugged in and on the computer I'm going to start an app called your phone now again for this to work you need to set up your phone to connect to Windows computer in the description box I have also included a link on how you can set up um, your phone and your uh, Android device. So take a look in the descri description box and see how you can link them together. Okay, so in here we can uh, click on photos again uh, on photos. I'm just going to open up this folder and delete the photos. And over here you can uh, choose a photo that you want to view. Uh, you can also drag it over. So just drag it over and then here you can uh, uh, copy the files. We'll see how you can uh, select multiple photos so I'm still trying to work out how you can select multiple photos over here at the moment you can just simply click and drag it over like so and so that is the photos that I just drag it over so it tells us three, tells us three different ways how you can um, copy photos or save uh, photos onto your Windows computer Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos.